it's different. So much for my bolt patterns. Look at that. Look at that. Will these four make it? Ooh. Yeah, these four will make it, right? Looks like one, two, three, four. Those should make it. And then I'll, I'll have to cut these off. Pour this. This is pretty deep. This is uh, three feet deep. Completely. what's great about this right how's everybody doing today welcome to not so sunny new jersey beautiful beautiful new jersey lovely hunterdon county however it's not the perfect solar day by any means so i've got 230 volts coming in and 289 volts coming in so many and mo many and mo and some loose wires and you can judge me on the comments, good or bad. It's nice having a hobby, right? I enjoy this. Let's go take a look at Manny and Mo. So, charging off solar. Actually, I'm using the batteries right now because there's no sun. So there's very little amps. We have voltage, but we have no amps. So Manny, Mo, and uh, EcoFlow has been fantastic. Really love the product. Couple changes happened. The base was different. I'm using all their hardware, except for these. These aren't theirs. These are much thicker. You can see how thin these are versus these. I think I showed you that already, but so I did upgrade those. I do like these little covers for the Unistrut. That's pretty cool. Now this is my ground array now. This was on Manny. Uh, I'm sorry, Mo. However, oh, it's starting to rain. Uh, the older brother Manny doing great, and Mo completely failed, and I had to replace him. Old stuff laying around, and uh, I'm gonna just reuse it. Spent enough on solar with the little bit of output I get, and then here you could see I am using all the solar panels now. And I wanted to do a test on bifacial. And it's true. Because <laughs> I'm getting the same voltage upside down as I am right side up. Can actually just adjust it the way I want. 
but I don't want to stretch any wires so I'm still in the setup mode so that again I don't want well this isn't gonna move so I got my positive comes all around positive out to the negative so these are all in series right so here's my negative so the negative goes over over around and around comes around to these four panels ends here so here's my loop right my negative uh, actually yeah this is the negative and this is the positive right here temporary on the ground obviously until now i did get two damaged solar panels they're going to send them because this kit was 994 dollars man with everything came with the tracker came with the solar panels came with everything you see here except the battery obviously my conduit that little junction box and that uh solar panel and we were looking at these before not real happy these are really this is starting to go too this was pretty tight but the thing is it's just on this little cotter pin here I'm not real happy with that because this is Manny and Manny was done properly Manny was done with 200 amp solar panels 200 watt solar panels six of them and you can see how they've shifted right you can see that but working smartly working smartly so it's Garrett We'll see you later from sunny, not so sunny New Jersey, beautiful New Jersey. The next project after this is the pool, fiberglass pool. It popped up, uh, didn't leave enough water in it over the winter and it broke. And I determined that because I have an outside pump that pumps all the outside groundwater around it underneath the cement. And as I lower that water, the pool lowers. So that's how you know you got a leak. Okay, well, it's Garrett from not so sunny New Jersey, but it will be beautiful and love having a hobby. See you later, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching my content. <laughs> so I just heard from Ecoworthy, very reputable company saying that they recognize that the couple solar panels are missing and they're going to get me out uh, the solar panels as soon as possible. So that's really nice. So I noticed that the solar industry has been better as far as response from these different com you know, companies and etc. So let's get a little bit of lunch. This is what happens when uh, you cannot cook. Oh, and by the way, I really like these. These have gotten me off Diet Coke. These Kirkland mineral water. I haven't had a Diet Coke since I discovered these. It's pretty incredible for me. Okay, well, we'll see you back from not so sunny New Jersey very soon.